I want to talk about uh, the breaking news story that happened in Seattle. Four officers had been uh, KIA um, by Black Lives Matter. These are terrorist groups funded by George Soros, uh, brought, brought in by the Muslim Brotherhood Antifa and by ISIS. They're all part of the Muslim Brotherhood. Black Lives Matter is a terrorist-run organization funded by George Soros and is oh. also embedded with the Muslim Brotherhood. And now Dr. Fauci, get this. Dr. Fauci just tweeted, since the officers have been has been KIA in action, they all have coronavirus. But then they have been he de, he they haven't even gone to the to the morgue yet, but yet he called them coronavirus. Oh wow. Yeah, because it's all an inside job to to do what they're doing, destroy America. And we are going to go after them. Like you said, we're going to go and take them down. That's called ballot box November, people. The ballot box. And remember that. I can't, I can't emphasize this enough. I mean, where does it say in the Constitution you have to wear a mask outside? I mean, you told me about, you, you told me about uh, um, if you, you, that you've been required to wear a mask outside. Otherwise, you'll get $200 fine. Is that correct right. in Texas? Yes. We actually got that for Harris County. Uh, we got a text message as an emergency, and that was during the uh, was the Fourth of July weekend. And uh, they're still implementing it, and that's just ridiculous. But like we said, give us the ticket, and we'll see you in court, and we're going to fight it. We don't care. Where's they cannot come and and do that to us. They can't. This like it's, it's like a Gestapo. It reminds me of Gestapo. Right, and you know, I was I was searching yesterday. And Mussolini. on top of the um, the con Congress uh, the Congress in um, D.C. right there's a statue and that's supposed to be a statue of freedom. Okay, and again, you know that's what con Congress is supposed to represent, but yet they're not. Uh, they are trying to make us a people of rules and a people of um, you know taking away our freedom. Like, Cheap, just court is it, and that's what you do. What we say. Yeah, it makes no sense. I mean, you have to go. They can't. We can't go to the store without wearing a mask. I mean, that's exactly what's going on in, in Houston, going on in California, Washington State, and Oregon. All, all, all for. And I wonder how many. I'm probably Chicago. I wouldn't surprise you. It was in Chicago and New York, or even Detroit, Michigan, right now. It wouldn't surprise you one darn bit. It wouldn't surprise me. It wouldn't. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yep. We're going to stand up, everyone. So everyone who's listening to this has to stand up. they got to, um, you know, fight because you stay there. We're actually having a protest on Friday uh, for the for what they did to cancel the Republican uh, convention. And uh, we've got a lot of people that are going to go. And it, protest in the city it's a hall. peace, but you, know, then, you know we're not. You might have shut us down, but we're not backing. I guess what I want to say that Republicans are as a peaceful demonstration. They're not violent. There is a peaceful demonstration, unlike Black Lives Matter, unlike any. I mean, if you saw um, All Lives Matter and what they did down the rally and uh, uh, what they did back in June twenty six, June twenty six. They had our Freedom Liberty Rally, and all they had was American flags. It was peaceful. They had a prayer. They had uh, they had a, um, a Pastor Dave down there. It was pretty cool to see that. Um, nice, peaceful demonstration as a peaceful demonstration. It was not uh -huh. a it was not a terrorist at all whatsoever. It was a peaceful demonstration. Now I'm sure you're going to have uh, somebody from. Uh, um, from a, a, say a, um, a reverend or a pastor too as well with a, opening with prayer too for your rally. I'm sure you will have that too. Will yeah. the will the pre, will the press mention that? No, no, they won't. They'll say that you got intimidated by the Black Lives Matter because they will come out and they will intimidate you. That that's all they show on the news net. That that's all they show on the news network. It's showing well, that's the other Well, their job is to intimidate for us to back down. It's just kind of like what they did now. They shut us down. Yeah. But if we just allow it, it's just going to keep happening everywhere and always. So we can't stop. We can't allow it. We won't allow it. It's not going to happen. Yeah. Uh, just bring your video camera. Bring your video chase. And you know, like I said, we. 
we will be happy to post it up here on his network for you people as for, for All anybody. Right. We make, will do that. I will make sure to take videos of the protests and, you know, all the people that come up. Yeah, so, well, we can podcast that. We can do that and have a live conference that way, too, as well. We can do all that live. We can do that on the air. Right, exactly. Right. Well, I can call you on Friday and we can do that, too. Well, uh, see what's out there. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of booked on Friday. I got another. I, I have a important call on on Friday. I'm already, I already have a previous show already booked already I booked this a week in advance and it's an important guest I have on uh, this is a um, uh, is, I'm, I don't want to get in details uh, but it's a public figure let's put it that way it's a public figure everybody won't everybody everybody knows her she's been on TV and radio a lot so everybody knows who this person I'm going to have on Friday so um, you guys don't want to tune into that, but we can do it in the we can do it in the late evening. Though we can do that, we can do it in late evening. We can do it at five. What time is your rally? I believe it's five. Five. Okay, five o'clock. Ah, shoot, I got an airport. I definitely got as a conflict for me. I can't do it. Um, we can do it Saturday. Though, okay, well, know. just let me know. That's not a problem. But you know, like you said, this was a breaking news thing, and this is about uh, the police officers. So you know. That's yeah. the most important thing right now that you have on the air. Yeah, it really is. I mean, this is we're broadcasting. It's more important than anything else we have because we and all what, lives what, matter. What county is this? What city was was this? Is, the, this, is, this is in this is in um, King County, by the way, King County, of Seattle, where this is uh, the the century. Okay, the Seattle, right? It's a century city, the century state. So you know, you know darn well that they got problems, and because of this, they get mayor. Mayor Judy Durkin already said, because this happened downtown, downtown Seattle, this happened in downtown Seattle. This Mount is Seattle, in which is King County. King okay. County, and I'm telling you, with Jimmy Dur with Jenny Durkin, okay, Jenny Durkin, Jenny Gestapo Durkin, is what I want to call her, Jimmy Gestapo Durkin, she wants to cut the police force by 50%, and Four officers got KIA due to these terrorist groups, and now Dr. Fauci says, since they, uh, since the all officers have been deceased now, they have all been declared as coronavirus victims. Uh, that is oh a new. Oh my God! This so you not only <sighs> not only are you a victim of a terrorist attack, you're now are a victim of coronavirus too as well. How does the families feel about that? I want to know. I really want to know how the families feel about this one, the families of the well, of the fallen. serious because we know it is not that. We know they're just trying to push the numbers. So they're using whatever they can to push the numbers to that. It's called desperate times and desperate measures. That's what you call the Democrats. Desperate times and desperate measures, and this is exactly what they do. This is exactly right. what they do. They this is called this is from the old playbook, by the way. And oh, I want to tell you something too. Uh, last night, <clears throat> since uh, uh, since Roger uh, Roger Odell, the, the commissioner of the NFL, wanted to uh, uh, call the Washington Redskins red feathers now of the of the the the, the sticky the, the, the sticky airmen, uh, uh -huh. the um. The Native Americans said we want the name put back, saying that we want to keep the name of of um, uh, um, of the Russian Redskins. They want to keep the name of the Washington Redskins. They want to keep it as well as a, as well, well as the Chiefs. They keep the name of the Washington Redskins, of course. As well as the Chiefs you too, know, as well. The Chiefs you know, Indian I, baseball. I they want to keep it very, too. They already said the chiefs. Uh, the chiefs already said the Native Americans already said we want to keep the names of the chiefs too as well. The chiefs, the Cleveland Indians, we want to keep the name of the chiefs too as well. They told the commissioner that, and they're still reviewing it. And now Robert Odell is getting all kinds of fight from the Native Americans, saying that we want to keep the name of the Washington Redskins. Why are you changing it? We already made a, this amendment six years ago. Why are you changing it now? Why are you doing this? Right. We we asked you to keep right. it, and you're not doing it now. It's, it's called racism. Roger Odell is a it's a social. He's a he's a Democrat social path. This is what he is. This guy is a monster. Right. This guy's a belong to be the be the commissioner. Right. He needs to be resigned. And the, yeah. and, and, you know, and you know how you vote him out? You go to uh, uh, the um the, these. Of, um, uh, the shareholders, the, the the people who have shares, 
who go right, to they can, they can, right. right. You go to the people who have who have the, 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 the you know the people who have. Of the stock in the stock market, you go to the shareholders of the stock market, and you bring it to Roger Odell to attention, and you bring it up there, and you ask where you hand the most. You hand them right in your pocketbook is where you do with yeah, ticket of sales. Course. That's what you do, right? You know, but I thought that this was just like uh, something that was going on. But when I actually went to the grocery store today, uh, well, yes, two days ago. They, I bought the same butter I buy, and it has a little Indian, okay? So then I brought it home. I noticed it didn't have the Indian, so I brought it home just to make sure my mind is not, not like, you know, uh, messing up or something. And then I had the old container, and the Indian was on it. And I took a picture, and I was like, OMG, like, they really did it. They really are taking things down for just something that they're assuming is racism. And people don't even care about that, but they're making it such a big deal. So I don't know if... Uh, you know, uh, Jemima, Jemima was taken down or not, but this one was, for sure. Oh, God. This is ridiculous. This is, just, this, this, is outrage 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 this is outrageous. I couldn't believe that they even allowed that to even... Outrageous. Oh, this is totally outrageous. Crazy, yes. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Outrageously crazy. Yep. Yeah. Outrageous. Is... Well, it was good talking to you. I've got to get some stuff done here where I'm at. Um, so thank you uh, for you know putting me on for the uh, breaking news on those police officers, and uh, you know we'll definitely whatever you need. To it's let sad. Me know. It's just sad. It just, I mean, every time I get you, I mean, it seems like every time I have you on, it's you have a breaking news on me. I got a breaking news story. I, I, I've been doing. I've been doing that the last the last three times now. Every single time, that Jamie, I have you on. I got a breaking news story just as I come, just before I come on you. As we, I know you always get me on that breaking news stuff, but it's okay. We three got it. It was done. Well, it was good talking to you. Thank you for calling and putting me on. Yeah, you're welcome. Like I said, I won't do it if Hi. I have a gas. I want it. I won't report it if I didn't have a gas. And sure enough, I had a gas. And this has been. This is every time there's a breaking news story. I have a guest on, and it turns out better than 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 I ever imagine or ever dreamed of ever dreamed of because um god put me here he put me in this position he did. so he sure did as um, yeah. and I, I, I was i'm bringing from no script i got no script at all here folks i have nothing here pre-planned the only thing i have was just of what I had from yesterday's news. I mean, not today's news. That was breaking news for what happened in Seattle today. It's all breaking news. So, um, thank you so much for your time. We'll see you again next time. And remember, we are. Thank you. And remember, we are looking out for America. We're not looking out for you. We are, in fact, looking out for America. Why? All right. lives matter, and we really do care. Thank you so much for your time, Jamie. Thank you. You take care. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.